park, right? I was sitting under a tree. I had at one point in time at least 20 relatives lined up to see me. All of them had a request. When I, I, I have relatives here in Atlanta, I used to perform at comedy clubs. They would be in the, in, the, in, the, in, the, in the hallway after the show waiting to see me just lined up. I got disconnection notices. Uh, my furnace is out. My car need repairing. I got medical bills. They would just line up. My father was living there, and this was his relatives. And my dad called me. He said, boy, did you see them down there? I said, yeah, man. He said, how was it? I said, dad, I ended up giving away about $20,000. He said, for what? I said, they got problems, and, and I helped them. My father made a phone call, shut all that <laughs> down. Asked this boy for another <laughs> quarter. And y'all gonna have to answer to me. And my father is not the one you want. So that was, that was my last time. I love my family, but you know, it's a lot. When you're the only one, and I'm the first one to really make it, you know, it come with a lot, man. Like, you know, I take care of my brothers and sisters. My, I'm the youngest one in my family, so I, I had two brothers. My oldest brother passed. I got my sister's 87 and Mona's 80, Mona's 87. My other sister is 85. And uh, my brother's 70, uh, 76. Not take care of them, you know what I mean? They ain't gotta work. They got their pensions and stuff. I pay them every year. Nice money so they can live good. You know, I don't want them to be hurting them. And then you put them on payroll, they ain't got to ask you for money. You get a check every month, so, you know, that, that stopped all that And they appreciate you, you know. But my, my, you know, my, my, my family old, man. They did a lot for me. My, my sister was pregnant at the same time my mother was pregnant. My sister was pregnant at 21. My mother was pregnant at 42. I was an accident for real. And my father never let me forget this either because I'd i be talking to him sometimes, be asking him a question. He said, boy, I don't even know why you talking to me. You ain't even supposed to be here. But he was up, man. My father was up. 